I am a first time storyteller and I'm terrified. <laughs> so I can start with my secret and my secret is that I may not be legit. I mean, seriously, I may not be legit because when my parents met, my mother was engaged to, well, for a while she was engaged to IAL Diamond. If anybody knows who that, he wrote Some Like It Hot. Anyway, um, I want to see you guys. Anyway, so she was a milliner and she was engaged and then she went to this dinner party and this man went to this dinner party and they met and they really, really liked each other. But he was from New Orleans. And so he went back down to New Orleans and they went, they talked to each other back and forth quite a bit. And then he came up to visit my mom again. And then my mom went down to New Orleans to visit him. And then he came back up and then he went back to New Orleans. And unbeknownst to my father, my mother broke off her engagement. She quit her job. She told everybody that she was going down to New Orleans to get married. And she went down to New Orleans and saw my father at this dinner party. And unbeknownst to him, she was there to marry him. So they were at this dinner party and they were drinking and drinking and drinking and having a great time. And one of their friends came up behind him and took their heads and smashed them together and said, you guys should get married. So they drank some more and they got in a car. And I don't know if, if y'all know New Orleans, but outside of New Orleans is a little town called Araby and there's not a whole lot in Araby. So my parents went, it was maybe three or four o'clock in the morning and my parents banged on the justice of the peace's door and this guy opened the door and they said, we want to get married. He said, fine, whatever. And he went ahead and he married them. But there was no witness. The only witness was a standing floor fan. <laughs> so, you know, maybe by common law by that time I might be legit, but then again, you know, I might not. Thank you. <laughs>